Hello, this video is part one of two parts. In this part, I will give, be giving you a problem, and in part two, I will give you the solution. The two words I'm going to parse are pharmacist and doctor. The first one, pharmacist, Google defines as person professionally qualified to prepare and dispense drugs. In Greek, the etymology is pharmax, which is preparer of drugs, poisoner, sorcerer. And then you go back further from pharmax to pharmakon, which is drug, poison, or spell. And then ist, ist is one who does or makes, which is contract. So a pharmacist really is a preparer of poisons or someone with a contract to prepare poisons. So when you walk into a pharmacy, you're walking into a poison factory. <laughs> the next word is doctor which Google translates as qualified practitioner of medicine. So Google is telling us that they're qualified to practice. So they can go practice. They're not a master or an authority. They're a practicer, a practitioner. They're just there practicing. In Latin, we have many, many different definitions for doctor. It tells us it's the church father, a religious teacher, to take, to accept, to alter, to falsify, to disguise, doctoring, doctorate. So this gives us new um, thoughts on these words, doctrine and doctorate, to falsify, alter, disguise. Now when I see oxymorons present in the definition of a word, that word is no contract. Let's go back a little further. What is a dock? A dock is a ship's berth. What is birth? Birth is space. OR is a quality of word, which means contract. So a doctor basically is a dock worker, a person with a contract to work on a dock, to work in a space. Dock worker. In part two, of this uh, little series, I'm going to give you some closure on two words that we may use in place of these uh, poison words. If you have any questions on this, please feel free to contact me at the email address included in the description below this video. I operate in the private and the confidential. Thank you for watching. I hope to see you in part two. Bye.